where pregnant parents seem to be exercising autonomy over their own biological goods, aka their umbilical cord and placenta. A mom posted this recently and it really resonated. She said that she regretted not doing something with her placenta and she didn't know that she could do something life-saving with her placenta, even though she paid over a thousand dollars upfront to do something with her umbilical cord. It was important to consider the benefits of having autonomy over your baby's stem cells, specifically from their umbilical cord and placenta. So when a baby is born, the umbilical cord and placenta are attached and the umbilical cord and placenta are really rich with stem cells. And these are basically like blank cells that can be used to replace and repair damaged cells. And they have life-saving potential. Stem cells specifically from the umbilical cord and placenta have been used to improve motor skills in children with cerebral palsy. There's early research looking at type 1 diabetes. It's been used for hair loss, heart failure treatment, Crohn's disease, neurological and immune disorders to treat acne scars, leukemia. It's also treated multiple sclerosis, various cancers, and so many more. And the reason that I know about this is because my younger brother actually had cerebral palsy, and my family found that they could have potentially used his umbilical cord or mine or maybe someone else's to improve his motor and social skills. Specifically because of this study at Duke University, 